All right, YouTube, we out here. Get ready to go to work. Make sure my lens is clean. Might not be the best way to clean it, but anyway. Do I really want a Harley Davidson? Man, I got that pretty M109R. And I got my go getter. Do I really want a Harley? Let's talk about it. All right, let's talk about it. Do I really want a Harley Davidson? Man, I, I, I don't know. This is, this is where I'm hung up. I've got two traveling motorcycles, really three, but we're going to Dadgum 86 to 109. I made it a bar hopping bike. It's got bags. It's got a bat wing. No doubt in my mind, it can travel. And they can travel with the best of them, you hear me? But I haven't traveled that bike in quite a few years because I have the gold wings. Well, I got an F6B for my backup. I'm riding it right now. The F6B, I'm riding it now. So, the F6B is a damn good looking motorcycle. I don't give a damn how you slice it. This motherfucker look good. It look good to me. <laughs> so, the gold wing, I'm going to be honest with you. I can't really compare it between Harley Davidson's, but my full gold wing is a beast when it comes to traveling. I'm telling you now, ain't no Harley Davidson going to do the things that my gold wing does and be as smooth and reliable as it is, in my opinion. So, do I need a gold? Do I, do I need a Harley? No, I don't need one. I guess the right answer will be do I want one? I do. I've never had one. I love the way they look. When I was uh, shopping for tour bikes, I was kind of torn between the Harley and the Goldwing. I like the way the Harleys look better. Not even knowing a whole lot about the culture. I like the way the Harleys, they just got that traditional look. That's why I like the M109. The gas tank is a gas tank. It ain't all plasticed up and everything else. So, I lean towards the reliability of a Honda. You know, the Goldwing. So I went with the Goldwing. The look of the Goldwing had to grow on me. I wasn't a real big fan of the way it looked, but it did grow on me. But, there's always a but somewhere. I think the Harleys look better. Now that I've been traveling and doing my thing and that Goldwing has done its job. You know, there's always a debate, Harley Goldwing, Harley Goldwing, Ford Chevy, Ford Chevy. They both are great motorcycles, I think. Never had a Harley. Uh, I know a lot of Goldwing folks make fun of Harley's got to change this and change that. We do the same thing. I've got Healy bars. I've changed my handlebars on here. I've changed my suspension on here. I've changed my seat on here to make it comfortable. These are the things that I know I definitely got to do because I'm six foot four, 350 pounds. I'm a big guy. So I got to set any bike up to fit my body. I did the same thing to my 109. I went with a cut back low Suzuki gel seat. And now I got eight hangers on it. So I got the handlebars out of my dick. 
I got him out of my lap, if you understand what I'm saying. So, what I'm saying is, I don't need no Harley. I damn sure want one. And I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to be real honest with you why. While I hit this damn curve on this Dagum F6B, double dark side, riding a car tire back there. Look at that boy lean that. Good God almighty. Look at him lean it, y'all. That's a, that's a go way for you right here. So, this is why I want the Dagum uh I would like to have a Harley. The culture. The Harley culture is off the chain. They damn good looking motorcycles. I can't really speak about how they ride. A lot of people I follow on YouTube, traveling tall, cycle fanatics, uh, holy shift, just to name a few of Harley guys that I like to follow. They travel them. Uh, Two-lane life. They travel the shit out of them. So, I'm not saying they can't travel, but my damn gold man travel so damn good, and it feels good, and I pull the trailer. All right, so, I'm doing this YouTube stuff. I think my channel would grow if I rode a Harley. All the traveling that I've done in all 48 states, get ready to go to Alaska. I think my channel would grow if I was on a Harley. Harley people support Harley people hands down. So you ask you, do I... Do I need a Harley? Now, I do want one. I like to experience the culture and uh, and all the hoopla. And maybe one day the good Lord willing and the creek don't rise, I'm going to get me one. Stay tuned. Who knows? This is where I normally get off the vlog. Seeing that pretty waterway, this bridge. Going down the interstate, 70 plus miles an hour, headed to therapy, and I'm thinking about buying me a daggum hog, y'all. I want to be a part of the cool club. Ah!